welcome everyone in this session we are going to demonstrate how to write PSSC data into excels using pandas in python so i've already opened a uh, ieee 30 bus system for demonstration purposes so what we are going to do is uh, we are going to uh, read some data from this case so let us read um, generator bus generator id similarly load bus and load id uh, and then populate this data into uh, excel in multiple sheets so one sheet for generator one sheet for load something like this so uh, starting on we have already discussed how to retrieve data uh, in the form of bulk um, data retrieval and in the form of uh, single element data retrieval so here i'm going to use this subsystem or bulk data retrieval so what i'm going to do is error so it gives stores error for me and in order to store the data in the form of a list so p is equal to pssby dot emac mm, yes so minus one is for um entire system so i want to read everything which is in the system so i'm not defining it by subsystems and you can go through the api uh, for more details and here i am interested in number so as soon as i yep everything went well so in the same way i'll just adjust this code to get the ids so gen id in this case for gen id i am interested in the character value so i've already discussed this as well and same thing instead of numbers we are now interested in id right so when we press enter we should get id in the same way let's get load bus so instead of machine and it is going to be area wide load end once again you can see these things from the api which we have already discussed where you can find them and then load id in the same way instead of mac or machine this time it should be a load so once i press enter i have uh, loaded all the data so if i want to see my data i can see this data as well so for instance i want to see how many generator buses are in this particular case so let's write gen bus so there are two gen buses in this case and how many load buses are there so let's write load bus and these are the load buses we have in our case okay so <coughs> let's write uh, this data into excel so for this we can use excel x writer you can also use openpy excel uh, so it's basically the writing engine so there are several available whichever you prefer you can uh, use this one similarly i am going to import pandas because i want to first write uh, all these data as a pandas data frame and then save this data frame into an with this let's create a data frame uh, for gen so let's call this data frame gen df or gen data frame this must then this is equal to pd which i have used for pandas data frame dot i want to create a new data frame so I have created an empty data frame. Let's write these values into this empty data frame. So I want to write the bus a number and the bus ID. So we can uh, write something like gen bus, uh, gen df is my data frame. And I want to create a column in this one, which is known as gen bus. 
so this will be the name of the column which is going to be displayed and what kind of data I'm going to write, it, write in it I'm going to write gen passing to it right so in same way GID for gen ID and I store the data of gen ID as right so in the same way <laughs> let's create another data frame which is going to store uh, the data of load for me so load data frame is equal to ed dot data frame so I have another so load df in this data frame I want load bus right that will be equal to load bus and in the same way I can use lid for load id and this will be load id so this way I have created two data frame uh, I mean if you are uh, already uh, familiar with pandas and everything or you have used it uh, you can perform any type of function which are available within pandas to you know, work and play with the data you have now uh, so uh, now for the storing uh, we'll store but before storing let's just try to see what kind of data I mean do we have the data in this data frame right now or not so what we can do is so let's just check to df dot head I just want to check I mean if data is available or not so you can see so load bus and IDs so data has already been included here so now let's write this data so how can we write this data so for this let's create uh, an excel file where we are going to write this data so let's call this excel file i triple e 30 bus base data or whatever you want to call it right so dot xls x so this is just the name i'm storing the name of this so now in order to write what we can do is we can use this power of pandas with pd dot so if we are going to use excel writer right and then we are going to give up xls file uh, which we want to write and then define the engine this is where i was talking about you can use xls writer open by excel that is totally up to you uh, so here i am using the xls x writer so i'll be using this one and then let's give it some options i mean these are not necessary so it's totally up to you uh, but i prefer to do it this way uh, because it makes me makes my data look easy so what i'm going to do is strengths to numbers so I want my data to be in the uh, numeric form rather than the strength form so this are uh, these are my options as writer okay so this is what I want to do and what do I want to write first of all I want to write gen df dot to underscore excel so I want to write my data frame to excel use the writer which I have defined above with this and because what um, basically what I'm trying to do is I'm uh, trying to write all the data into one excel sheet with multiple sheets uh, so that's why uh, I'm using this so they're going to be one Excel uh, book with two sheets one for the generator data one for the load data in same way you can have multiple for branches and everything it's totally up to you what you, uh, basically what you want to do with this data 
so what is going to be my sheet name my sheet name is going to be gen data so this is one of my sheet and I do not want to write the indexes because if you see here these indexes 0 1 I'm not interested in this so I'm going to just write index is equal to false please don't write the index so this is basically I'm trying to tell my uh, options so in the same way load df dot to underscore excel then write the sheet uh, sheet underscore name is equal to this time it's load data right and then again I do not want to write my index now you can play with these options you can do whatever you want uh, to uh, so once I press enter and enter again so my data should be written